Yeah, I should probably do something about that. What's up, MS Evers? We're gonna be blitzing today. Yeah, sorry. My blitz alarm literally just went off. I need to do a blitz rotation. But other than that, we've got some fun stuff. We're gonna be talking about the free orbs we're gonna start collecting tonight. Or I think we're getting part of an orb or something like that. So uh, yeah, that's that's what we're gonna be doing. We've got, I don't know if I'm gonna do raids or not today, but I do have to do a scourge run, that pestilence scourge run. Turns out there's some like, like timed run things or something. There's rewards in there, now I have to do it, so I'm gonna do that. I also have the Cosmic Crucible, which I'm gonna do. Hopefully I'll get some friends on the line and help me through that. Shouldn't be too tough. I do have a Dormhold team in there that I am not very good at those because I don't, I don't do them a lot except for in Arena and that's a whole different bag. I got some war attacks to do and some other stuff. We're gonna keep it pretty simple today. We do have a defense up video, which I just realized I didn't prep for, so maybe I won't even do that because, ah, eh, whatever. I might, I might, I might not, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Anyway, how y'all doing? What's up? I'm gonna skip all the bots today. Lizzie Beth, Lane of Death Lurks. What's up, Madman? Sandor Clegane. Hey, Sandor, did you get your bill in the mail, buddy? We uh, we were watching you on the bus ride. It was a bumpy bus ride the other day, and you kept sitting on your phone, and it was mashing that subscribe button. How'd that how'd that go for you? <laughs> Sandor Clegane, everybody. Uh, Shit Shaker, how you doing? Small streamers, dog. Small streamers DC community? Okay. Wow, we got lots of bots that are joining us these days. <laughs> What's up? Oh, wow, that's another bot too. Holy cow! What's up, Omega Red? What's up, Dom Dell? What's up, Duke Alien? What y'all doing today? Did you guys catch that new intro? Did you see that? I just finished putting that together. Let's crack open some energy today. Ah, there we go. Rockstar punched. I'm loving these things. Fruit punch flavored rock stars. They're mostly sugar and caffeine. They say something about some sort of vitamins on them, but I don't know. Oh! Oh, I just brushed my teeth. That tastes terrible. Oh, that tastes so terrible. Oh my god. Don't don't drink them after brushing your teeth. That's horrifying. Ugh. Oh god. <laughs> Give me some water. <laughs> Click it. I want to be famous. What are you talking about, New Shocker? What do we want to click on to be famous? What's up, Bandit 2? What's up, Steven? <laughs> it's a great day in MSF. Scopely's not to work yet, so they haven't messed anything up. <laughs> What's up, TLC? Holy mother of white lines! Oh my god, they're everywhere! Oh man, that's brutal. I just fixed this shit, too. What's going on here? Let me see if I can if I can tweak on that. That's gonna be my MSF window, which is this one. We're gonna hit that Alt key and stretch that out. Did that work? No, that didn't do anything. There. How's that? Did that do it? I got rid of one of them. Let's see if I can't get rid of this one over here on the other side. We're gonna we're gonna go. No, it's not gonna move, you son of a gun. Did I get rid of it? Did it go away? Damn it, still there. Okay, one more try, here we go. Here we go. All right, oh no, it's on the other side. Oh my gosh, I can't get away from him. What if I do, okay, what if I do this? I'll go here, I'm gonna make it bigger. I don't know if that made it bigger or not. Son of a bitch, I can't win with this thing. <laughs> There's that one. And th this side's all screwed up. That doesn't even, oh, now I'm getting smaller. No! <laughs> okay, all this, we're gonna go there. Squeegee those lines in. What if we, 
Okay. Boom. Oh, fuck it. Close enough. White Line Wednesday, baby. That's what we're calling this stream. White Line Wednesday. <laughs> it's going to be a thing. <laughs> <laughs> Weapons Z, did you like that? Y yesterday's news today? I hope more people enjoy those. I want you guys to be able to get all the important information on a daily basis and not have to scour through too many videos. I point out the good videos that are maybe worth your time. I skip over all the stuff that isn't important. However, don't be offended if you're a content creator who is making content and I don't plug your video. It doesn't mean your video is crap just means that your video is some of the same stuff like there's a lot of people who are putting out cosmic crucible content and it's good stuff it's just they put it out on a regular basis i don't really need to plug it i was thinking next time there's a slow day i was gonna go through all the all the different people that don't normally get plugs like boylan's plugged in the video like on the daily he used excuse me he usually has relevant information coming out and so i tend to like Oh man, Whew. I usually have to like point to his videos a lot, but there are other people out there that are making some pretty good content that people might be interested in. So I was thinking about making on a slow day, making a video that just highlights, hey, look at this person, this is what they do. Look at this person, this is what they do. Professor Chaos, yeah, it's it's kind of it's kind of like the like the way orange juice is like sour and sharp tasting. This is like. I don't even want to describe it. It's pretty bad. After toothpaste, it is. At least they're trying to fix things rather than ignoring the issues. Yeah, Ray Barn, they're doing something about it. I still, I want to find out what the math is. Like how many rotations, speaking of which, I could be doing rotations while I run my mouth here. How many rotations do we have to be doing now that we're getting two and a half orbs worth of shards? What's up, miniatures? Hey, miniatures, I see that you followed yesterday. Dude, you're here like nearly every day. What the fuck are you just now following for? Did you unfollow? Did I say something and send you away and then you changed your mind and came back? Is that what it was? That's right. If you unfollow my stream, I will hunt you down. I will find you and I will drag you back to my stream. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not that intense. <clears throat> Yeah, that's quality content, the line, the line buffering, yeah. It just pisses me off because I came into the studio an hour early. It's my bedroom, it's not a studio. I came in here an hour early to like fix things because remember on Monday's stream, it was all messed up. There was a camera that I couldn't get rid of and the, free, and the stream was freezing up and dropping out and really pissing me off. So I came in to make sure that everything worked and now we're back to white line Wednesdays. What's up, face one? How you doing? <laughs> White Line Wednesday can really read different for some people. Yeah, it's the internet. 100% of the time, you will piss off at least 1% or more of the people who are watching you. There's no getting around that. I have learned that the best thing to do is don't apologize. Just own it. Just own it, because you're going to piss somebody off. So just own it and keep moving forward. I'm not here to intentionally offend people, but if you are offended, fuck off and watch somebody else, man. I ain't got time for that shit. If you don't like me, there's a gazillion other streamers. Speaking of which, there's a lot more MSF streamers this week. I found like five new people I've never even heard of this week. I was actually kind of impressed. Like, And there's some people who've been playing the game for a minute, not just like, no, like at first I was like, oh, Scopely must be pushing one of those promos and these other streamers are playing. But like I was talking to like one of them and he was like, no, this is I'm starting a new account. It's my second account. I've actually been playing for a while. Get your hair did. I got I have the purple sticky haircut today. There we go. <clears throat> You're now streaming with Purple Sticky. <laughs> it's okay, I have permission to make fun of him in this way. <laughs> See, you're gonna piss off at least 1% of everybody all the time. 
Jesus. Did I see the data mines? Specifically, what are you talking about, Madman? I looked at the data mines this morning about, oh, there was the one about Nokia. There's the one about some, oh, some gold. There might be a reason to be saving your gold orbs. So I think that we should just go ahead and save our gold orbs for the time being. That's right, Madman, the gold spending event coming in, yeah. Uh, we don't, I mean, it's a data mine. They don't, they haven't been doing gold spending events for quite some time. So I'm kind of, I can't hear shit through this, this helmet. I don't even know why I'm wearing my earphones right now. I don't know. They don't tend to do the gold spending events much anymore. Those were not really well received. And it, it's a broad range of people, of outcomes, because some people like my wife, who literally has 50 million gold and 600 gold orbs. And then there's people like me who on the other end of that spectrum that has 200 uh, ability mat orbs, not abilities, is it ability, uh, training, training materials? Training mats. Is it training mats? That's the one I'm thinking of. The other, the other end of the bottleneck, right? You either have the gold or the training mats. I've got the training mats. I don't have the gold. My wife has the gold, not the training mats. So you get this wide spectrum of people and how those outcomes come out. They don't like that. They like a very controlled outcome to their events. And so I don't think it's, if it is a gold spending event, the gold portion of it is going to be very, very inconsequential. That's my prediction. And of course, this is just a data mine. So who knows? Marble Horde Force. That's right. What's up, Professor Chaos? How you been? Benny Westside's got some things for me to click on here. Oh, Benny's got the uh, new infographics. I saw those, Benny. I saw those, buddy. You want me to show those off to everybody? Here, let's take a look at them. So we've got the Nokia, no, I'm sorry, not Nokia, Okoye infographic here. This is coming from Benny Westside and Tana. Is there anybody else in, in on that, Benny, or is it just you two on this one? And then it looks like we have the Weaver one over here. <clears throat> this is data mined information and is always subject to change. This event was announced to start November 14th. Strike salute milestones and the commander's cash milestone. Okay, so these are the event ones. I didn't know you guys were breaking these down into events. I probably would have plugged that in the recap. I thought this was a, some sort of a character review. I just glanced at him, buddy. I'm sorry, I'll have, to, I'll have to pay attention to these more often. Rack up points to climb the ranks of this leaderboard. The top 1% will earn red stars for Black Panther 1 million. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, they fucked up on that Black Panther, didn't they? <laughs> that looks cool. That looks cool. <clears throat> wow, you guys are scrolling back. I would argue data mines are now less subject to change than blogs. Steven, you got a point there, actually. Honestly, they you're right. You're actually right, Steven. They make more changes to their blog posts than they do the data mines. I don't know, Dom Del, click on those links that Benny just put there in chat. Go over, you can go over them with a fine tooth comb and find out. I gotta finish this blitz run so I can restart my timer and then we can go back and, and look over those in detail. I have 19 mil in the bank and over 200 orbs saved, you're good. Way to Queen will win the event. Oh my goodness. If she, if she jumps into chat, you better, you better show her that you're calling her Way to Queen now. She's gonna just love having, she's gonna make you like leader of her fan club. I have a good bottleneck and so many orbs are like none right now. I have a gold bottleneck and so many orbs are like none right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm broke as hell. <clears throat> I'm broke as hell in game. I'm broke as hell, that's, that's a blanket statement. The salute event would make up for the difference in armory orbs. I'm not really feeling the armory crunch. I'm kind of glad I didn't purchase that offer. I have a feeling 
Juicy resubscribe with Prime. They've been subscribed for three months. Juicy, you're fucking awesome, but you already knew that, didn't you? Remember, we have uh, two days left on if you want three free months of Xbox Live for PC or Xbox Game Pass for PC. Just uh, gift a sub or two. You got to gift two subs or buy a sub and gift one. Two subs. You got to do two subs. And you get that for free, but you get that with anybody's stream. So head on over to Pathfinder Stream and hit subscribe. What's up, cleaning agent? The black and green are always for data mines. I will remember that. Thank you, Benny. That's going to make my life easier now that you guys have those concise data mined infographics. I can throw those up on the screen of the recap when I'm talking about those events, and it'll be easier to highlight the information. So thank you guys for putting those together, and thank you for pointing them out to me. You're glad you didn't buy it as well? I... There's, there's several possible outcomes from that, and I know we kind of beat this uh, the horse to death here, but I, I kind of want to point it out to somebody. A lot of people are still... A lot of people are still coming to me with some wild-ass ideas and stuff. The conspiracy people, you guys can just stop, okay? You're not going to convince me, I'm sorry. I, I refuse to listen to some of that nonsense. Um, <clears throat> one... They're going to make all the future characters more expensive to offset the influx of those pieces. I don't believe that would happen because that would piss off literally everyone. It would piss off the people who bought it. It would definitely piss off the people who didn't buy it. It would piss off everyone. I don't think that would be a wise choice for Scopely. Not to mention there is a 20,000 orbs, guys. There's people who are telling me it, it took them a couple of hours to open them all. You, you, it's just ridiculous. Most people aren't even opening them. They're just letting the bundle sit there until they need something. So I don't believe that's going to happen. Nor do I think that they will immediately open the floodgates on those in order to help the free-to-play players catch up because that would piss off the people who bought the offer, correct? So I think what's going to happen is Scopely's just not going to pay any attention to those. They're going to get released. They're going to get come into the to the game like normal. I, I think that they will slowly over time increase that flow a little bit, but they're probably just not going to pay too much attention to it. And so in the long run, I think the people who didn't buy the offer are going to benefit to a degree. And of course, the people who bought the offer have instant bonus to their accounts. And that's kind of how it should be, right? You pay money to get there faster. Not pay to win. It shouldn't be pay to win. It should be pay to not have to wait for shit or whatever catchy phrase you have there. Okay, start my two hour timer. Got a brand new phone. Got a brand new phone. Valley, fine, coming in with a big raid. Thank you, Valley. We were just talking about a bunch of stuff doing our, doing our blitz rotations, right? Maybe we don't need to do as many blitz rotations, but we still have to do some. Um, I am going to be doing, I'm still going to be shooting for at least six rotations a day right now. And I don't, I don't know. I'm waiting for Boylan or maybe Pathfinder could get us the math on that. Does anybody know the math now that we're getting the extra 5,000 shards, orb shards? Because I would like to know how much I'm supposed to be blitzing. For right now, I'm going to be doing six rotations. I just finished that and set my alarm. Which led me to pointing out that I bought a new phone, and that's not a brag. I wanted to bring that conversation around to the fact that the store and the the Milestone web store, um, MSFGG, all that stuff, on my brand new phone runs so freaking smooth. It is it's enjoyable to go in there to MSFGG and mess around with my account. I, I can click on the store and it's like instantaneously brought up and I can click power orbs and drop down to the free thing at the bottom. The, the, the milestone pages are redeeming fast. It's working. It is working and I'm happy and not enough people are pointing to the good stuff in this game. And I wanted to point out that they, are, they did a good job with it. You may have to buy a new phone soon, depending on where you're at on memory in your in your phone or your or your portable device. Or you could run it on blue stacks, which kind of runs like crap still. But that's a blue stacks issue. But I'm just saying that that's that's something to be happy about. They did something right. 
They tried to fix this blitz event because we were blitzing way too much for it. And that's a good thing. What's up, Howlett? That's actually a wig, Howlett. It could be a hat or a wig. Somebody redeemed some uh, get your hair did, and so I had to wear a wig for five minutes. That was the wig I chose for today. Did they update the web milestones yet? I don't know if they, why would they need to update the web milestones? What was wrong with them, Benny? They're gifting us 5,000 shards over the next five days. They said the 9th, 10th, 12th, was it the 9th, 10th, 12th, and 13th, but I don't remember them saying the 11th. And it's 5,000 shards. I wonder if it's supposed to be five offers over five days and that, I don't know. Nick I got a, um, a Galaxy phone. I like the Galaxy S series. Has a stylus, it's fantastic. I like my stylus, I think it's great. Ooh, can I do anything in this node? Probably not. I don't think the dad bros can get me through here. I don't think Madeline's gonna do me any good either. Beast, probably not a great choice. Maybe if, I don't know. I don't know if I can finish this node off. <clears throat> How the heck did I grow my beard already? It grows fast, man. I got tree trunks for beards, man. I mean, it's it's thick. Let's see what I can do to these two. Not land a damn thing. That's what I can do. I don't think this is going to do much damage with that defense up. Am I right? But depending on what she's on with that offense up, she's going to delete a mofo. I think I better do the damage while I can. I'm gonna, no, she's gonna heal up. I'm gonna go with this one. Since there's two of them there, split the difference. Is this rebounding chain? Rebound chain, there we go. <clears throat> Something. Ouch, ouch, son of a gun. See if I can't slow her down a little bit. Give me, oh, she's got her charge, man. That ain't gonna work. Come on. What a bunch of crap. <laughs> I'll tickle Wong, I guess. That's garbage. <clears throat> Blinder, she's gonna cleanse it. Oh, this is pointless. I brought in the wrong people for this. Fine, I'll take the charge off her, doesn't matter. Uh, let's keep hitting her. Come on! I don't think I don't think I have what it takes. Don't think I have what it takes to get through her. Now I'm not gonna make it. <clears throat> I'll be lucky if she doesn't kill me. I'll time out on this before before I beat it. Where did I where did I get the phone? Uh, I got it through T-Mobile. <clears throat> oh my goodness. <clears throat> Yeah, let's just say that it's an S series. Let's just say that it's an S series. I don't want to embarrass myself with my. I will just call it an S series. I only have two time for two rotations, one before bed and one when I wake up. That's kind of where I was at. I'm trying my best, but it's not really happening. You don't, you don't know where I've been. What's going 
CMAA wasn't very clear about what changes are coming to the Blitz event. They announced yesterday they miscalculated the web milestones. They will readjust them to require much less blitzing. Did I misunderstand that part? I thought they were just going to gift out the 5,000 shards. That was my understanding, that they were only going to gift it out. Let me go take, take a look at that. <clears throat> That's news leaks and stuff. An important update to the Contagion event. Check it out here. The intention for the Contagion core event that players can acquire the Panther Pell via moderate engagement investment. The viral vision milestone point values will be adjusted to align with our intended design. How did I miss that? Wow. How did I miss that line? As such, in addition to spending campaign energy on certain nodes and through the web milestones, multiple free claims via the website will be available. Okay. <clears throat> so I totally bombed that one, didn't I? The viral mission, the viral vision milestone point values will be adjusted to align with our intended design. Well, that's good. Maybe I can um, get back to that then. Both the 5,000 shards and the change to the web milestones. Yeah, Domdell, I caught that in Mobile's video that he said 5K is about a day's worth of blitzing, <clears throat> which over a seven day event, when you have to blitz seven times, the math in my head said I needed to still do six. I just totally didn't hear that part. I don't know why people got so enraged about the 2,500 free orbs. I don't know, man. <clears throat> I don't know. We'll have to see how it all plays out. Let me see if I can go in and, and just get this one node. I don't think I have enough to get through Kestrel. I could do this. I could just throw in some big boys with Beast. Wolverine might do some damage. I don't want to heal anybody else. So... I don't think Storm's going to do me any good. I don't know. Maybe she will. I don't know. We're going to try this. We're going to heal these two. We're going to go back in and we're going to take care of Kestrel. <clears throat> yeah, I hit record miniatures. Thank you for reminding me. Yeah, I could have done Samurai, but I don't think my Samurai is big enough to land anything on Kestrel, so I'm hoping that Rogue can do it for me. Good thing I brought in Storm, huh? Beast ain't gonna flip it. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, the white line, man. Drives me absolutely bonkers. And you guys are gonna keep reminding me of it all stream, aren't you? <laughs> Maybe they mess up again and do 5,000 orbs instead of shards. Wouldn't that be fun? Everybody's crying because they think they're not going to be able to get a four-star panther. <clears throat> and they end up getting a seven-star panther instead. <laughs> <clears throat>
Oh, we're done there. Okay. People are confused about how the change the changes impact the event because the event is so convoluted with so many moving parts. Heck, even Scopely did not understand the event. That's how they miscalculated to begin with. <clears throat> it is a confusing one. I know the first couple of days, I was like, I don't even get it. Then again, I'm not, you know, the, the sharpest tool in the shed. The Thin White Line coming this fall to a Twitch stream near you. I, I don't know, Howlett. I don't know if they would roll the game back for that. They are so hesitant to roll the game back. It blows me away. But at the same time, they'll pull an offer. They'll pull an offer. And every single time they have pulled an offer, they have had to put it back up. If they pull the offer, they should roll back the game. That's the point of pulling the offer, is to put the brakes to a situation so that when you do have time to bring down the servers, roll it back, you only have to correct a small portion of people that got to the offer. So if you're going to pull the offer, roll back the freaking game. Otherwise, leave the offer up. Just leave it up. Stop screwing with people. Oh, and Rich on Ships just showed up. No targets, huh? Okay, let's take a look at Barracks and Armory. I don't know, do I have a Black Order? I don't think I have a Black Order left over. Nope. I have not a lot, actually. I don't have a lot left over. The people who pulled the offer do not have the authority to roll the servers back. That's that's a good point, Vexer. Left hand doesn't know what the right's doing. So they pull the offer to cover any eventual case. And then the people who decide to roll back the, the servers, yeah. Scopely meant to increase blitzing to encourage spending, but the blowback by the community made them revert to the old numbers. Could be, cleaning agent. I'm trying not to get involved in some of the conspiracy shit that's been going on. I know that stuff's fun, but man, it kind of got out of control, and I had so many people messaging me with their conspiracy theory ideas, and I, I was like, dude, I don't care. I don't, I don't really care. I'm not saying that those people are wrong either. Some of those conspiracies sound very logical. There's even a lot of data to support some of them. I'm not saying that people are crazy. I'm just saying you can't prove it either way. So it's kind of a pointless conversation until a Scopely employee comes out and blows the whistle on some of that stuff. Like, what's the point in arguing about it? Do I have Bionic Avengers available? I don't know if I do or not. Yeah, let's do that one. <clears throat> Daily dose of that ass, baby. You're so happy you don't have to for farm 14s and 15s right now? I was never farming 14s and 15s anyways. I have enough. Sometimes I gotta go fetch a few, but most of the time I don't really. It's all the catalysts. It's just catalysts for me is all I've ever had to do. They made so much money from that offer, they don't... Though I don't know why they don't... More things out like it. Maybe not to the extent of 40,000 orbs. Well, Hala, it's really hard for them to control the economy when they give out heavy amounts of anything. And they're not smart enough to be able to control that. They can't think ahead and figure it out. So they put out teeny tiny amounts for very expensive amounts of money and they do that over and over and over. And that way they can they can put out a little bit and they see how that affects the economy. Putting out large amounts just never really works because why not put out some like a 99 cent offer for 10,000 purple gear orbs or something ridiculous like that, right? So that the newer players can just grab that and get caught up and make a more competitive game. But they're afraid to do that sort of thing, even though no one's, you know, no one's really going to pay for like they have 
purple gear offers for sale, but no one's really buying that crap because it's just, it doesn't take very long to get going. What am I doing? I could throw this on auto for crying out loud. Well, we know from the gold mail bug, they have a game save state around store reset. Knowing Scopely, they probably forgot to move the save state to take into account the new reset times, so they might not have been able to roll back for the G1415 error. That's another good idea there, Steven. Opie with the follow. Thank you, my friend. Be sure to drop by chat, say hello. I like it when people talk to me. I don't play this game for the game. I play this game for the community. <clears throat> I'm kind of curious. I want to see where it times out. I don't know if this is going to work or not, but my alliance doesn't care. I just want to see how this times out with just a Weaver, no 99. They put the orb mistake out there so the whales can catch up to you, Chuck Wolf. People can, if you have a conspiracy theory, send it to cleaning agent. It's a hot take. He's asking for conspiracy theories. Honestly, cleaning agent, you could do a segment on the conspiracy theories, and I think it would, I think that would come out very good. I'm wondering, what if I do this to Weaver and just make her disappear? That way I don't have to deal with Spider Weaver. That's a good idea. I liked that. That worked out well. We're gonna stun her. I know that's not a great place to put it, but I freaking hate Yo-Yo. She just annoys me so much. And then let's go after Squirrel Girl. I had Catalyst Gold, but 1415s are actually the worst for me. The other two were manageable. What's up, Jarvis? How you doing? Cats and mats are my biggest bottleneck. Lane of death, you ran Scarlet Spider as the healer and one shot the second bio node. Hey man, everybody laughed at me for doing it. I never recommend it to anybody, but I don't have any problems with it. I haven't tried the other the other ISIS. I haven't tried Raider or Striker. I don't know why you do Striker. Some people said Striker. But I haven't tried Raider, so I don't know. But it's working with healers, so I'm not gonna change it back. I got a cleanse in there somehow. Uh oh, Squirrel Girl cleansed. I should have stunned Squirrel Girl. What was I thinking? Why didn't you guys tell me that? Let's get these over here. Sheesh. Boom. And we're gonna shoot you. I probably could have gone into the person with defense down. That would have been the way to go. Man, I'm playing this one terrible. Should probably just put it on auto. In fact, let's do that. I have so much purple gear backstocked, I'd never need to farm any for any character I unlock in the future. Yeah, Chuck, well, if I have something like 25,000 uh, purple gear orbs or something like that, I, I, I yeah, I, honestly, once in a while, I will run out of green gear. I'll have to go, like, I'll spend my three store purchases on green gear because every once in a while, you just run, you, you actually bottom out on that because you're not doing any nodes that, that give that to you. Just here for the blazer. Well, Rich on Chips, we're going to get that blazer out here pretty soon. Okay, I got three more attacks that I have to do. 
I just used my, oh man, I wish I would have known that SA was there. I would have saved my SA team for that. I could have mirrored it because they put Fury in there. That's a no-no. I don't know. Maybe my Axemen can take him. I'm not sure. Do I have my Axemen available? Yes, I do. I don't know if I can punch up that high into him. I don't know. Eh, what the heck? We'll give it a shot. I don't know if I can do this or not. I agree with Juicy. They're done with the orange gear and mostly will release new uniques, but those can be made up by hoarding orange elites. Well, son of a gun, I think this is a loss. Without Bishop to clip those three off in my next move, that's not going to work. So we're out of here. I was hoping Bishop would sustain that attack, but that was a big old Kestrel and she created all over my face. My God, I can't take that white line. Oh my God, I just can't do it. Come on, just a hair. That's all I need. Thank you. There we go. We got rid of it. We got rid of the white line, yay! <laughs> What's up, Providence? How you doing? We just fixed white line Wednesdays. It's now normal Wednesdays. <laughs> what do I even have to attack with? I keep forgetting. I have Darkhold, Infinity Watch, Axemen, and Eternals. I guess I could Eternals this. I could probably just Eternals this, I guess. <clears throat> Oh, I have Unlimited, too. We'll throw in Spider Weaver for fun. And what the heck? Why not Zemo, too? I'm not going to need any of these people. I'm out of attacks. Playing Snap, waiting for your Blitz timer to go off. <laughs> A lot of people playing Snap, man. I see Mortal Kombat Onslaught is out. Is that for beta? Is that like a soft launch? Where, where's that game at? I see there's some, some people playing it. Let's do the ability block here. And we're going to put... I don't know. I think you're kind of squishy. Let's try that. Oh, I didn't get a kill? Wow. Okay. Kind of growing tired of war. Are you guys growing tired of war? I'm not feeling it these days. I'm, I'm enjoying Crucible a lot more now. Those bunch of armory orbs do very little for non-spenders. You'll run out of gold and training mats before long. Oh, if you're someone who is in the process of completing DD4, DD3, buying the offer basically finishes both farms for it. Yeah, I didn't think it was a big deal. a half gamma half unlimited Let's see where this comes out Just for the heck of it, let's try and see what this does. I don't know if I want her there. That's a bad placement. Why do I have him saved like that? That's a gross placement. Oh, come on. Stupid. I hate when it does that.
Give me the dark old characters. Thank you. Okay, that'll have to do, I guess. There's a better placement, I know, but this is gonna have to do. CC has taken over war for sure. Got tired of war about two years ago. What's up, killing it? Morning, Purple Sticky. We were impersonating you earlier today. Somebody give Purple Sticky a shout out. Cleaning agent needs a shout out too. Hell, half the people in here need a shout out. Let's go after Rogue with this. That'll help. Get her covered in all those goodies. And we're going to hit you because I want a disrupt on you. We're going to stun Gambit, the old Gambino. And let's even do some damage to him, shall we? Actually, yeah, let's do that. I want the taunt. I want the taunt up. No, I didn't see the tribute to me at the at the last of your CC vid. I was watching you record that and then jumped out before you finished it. If, if we're talking about the same CC battle, well, I'm going to have to go back and watch. See if I can't get a kill here. Not, probably not a kill, but I'll get him whittled down a bit. Yeah, we did get the kill. Awesome. Nice. It's not like this is a challenging match when you throw in Undying, but whatever. I got more. I got more people than I got energy. He did the recorded live with little or no editing line. I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> I will. That's the first thing I'm going to do when I shut down stream. Purple Sticky is go check out your video. I did. When did you post that? Did you post that just now? Because I didn't see any new new videos when when did that one go live i always check youtube like an like an hour hour and a half before i stream to make sure i've caught everything in the past 24 hours and i didn't see any new videos i think that's it for me and war thank goodness we're done with that uh juicy did you want to jump into the stream channel and we'll talk about cosmic crucible because i did not prep my defense up video for today it's a war defense i didn't prep it i'm not going to sit there and do that on stream so i think we'll just talk about crucible and i'll go in and do my crucible attacks if you want to jump in and talk with me juicy you can or purple sticky or anybody else who has the authorization there Okay, I was watching the stream last night. I missed that part. How did I miss that? I don't know. I had a PTO meeting last night, and it was kind of in the middle of a lot of things. Okay, so my biggest problem is dark hold here, or dorm hold here. However, I think the rest of it's going to be fairly straightforward. They've got Gamma in five which I think I can handle. And then they've got Legendary Soup in six. So we were thinking, 
using unlimited on this maybe with a sack i was actually considering going into it with infinity watch then using unlimited to sack this team team number one Yeah, because in the results, here's what happened with the defenses. So they mirrored Black Order. They went into this hot mess with Bionic Avengers, which seemed to do just fine. Then my Tangled Dad Bros held. And I don't know why they would combat cancel. I guess to save the team, I guess. But they tried They tried a bunch of different stuff. Look, they had uh, Tangled Undying. They had Tangled Uncanny. And then they used Weapon X and couldn't get through it. Honestly, they should have just double tapped the dang room. I don't know why, but whatever. I'll take it. So all I've got to do is 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 clear all their rooms. Then they barely squeezed by with their A Force with them. Um, a Force with Yo Yo. That's kind of a weird choice, but it got the job done. Huge punch down though. That was kind of weird that that happened. And then over here they did a Dark Hunter Mirror. Uh, quite a large punch down there. 300k punch down for that one. So this was my Dark Hunters with Yo-Yo, by the way. And so I was hoping for a better result than this. They were able to just punch down with their Dark Hunter. I wanted to see a different team go into it and see how it held, but whatever. And then they used Unlimited on my Room 6 Gamma, which this was all healer Gamma, and they punched down 100k. So they punched down 100k and it's still, eh, it's okay, I guess. So anyway, I got to clean this up. I'll show you what I got to work with. Here's my teams. I labeled them all out and put them in a nice order. So I've got my Dark Hold. I do have Dormammu. I'm thinking this is probably going to go into Axemen. I don't really have a use for this. I think this is probably going to, going to go into that legendary soup in room six. Bionic Avengers will take out their Web Warriors. I think I was going to use this for the sack team on their dorm hold and then come back with my unlimited. My unlimited is only like 700, I think. I've got an Axeman to do things with. Here's my unlimited. It's only 700, but it's up and running anyways. I got my D-Force, which I don't know if I'm going to use that. Now we're getting down into the hybrids here. Oh, I need to pull Red Guardian off of defense. I need him for this hybrid. Eternals. Ignore the symbiotes. They just happen to be available. I use them as a sack team or something. Some more. This is for Asgardians. I can, I can use that on Asgardians and then Undying. So that's what I got. We'll see how it goes. Unlimited the dorm, it'll clear the revives. Right, but should I still go in with a sack team? I'm just not sure. Yeah, for a 700k unlimited, unlimited X-Men to go into a 1200 dorm hole, that's my thinking. Dorm Unlimited and one-shot the dorm home. Just remember, guys, I don't need to one-shot anything. I just got to clear all the rooms. So I'm kind of thinking, trying to, like, make sure I have as many options available. What's up, Jedi Cowboy? How you doing? Worst case, you kill MLF and dorm and come back with iWatch. Okay, so you guys are saying I should do Dorm Unlimited, is what you're telling me. Probably a placement change, maybe? Actually, no, because Dorm... dorm my Dormammu is so much tankier than these three. Although they're going to get revives because there's no Kuro mutants in here. Okay, I think I'll go with this. I think this gives me a great chance. The, the hero mutant is going to neuter their Dormammu. 
I just gotta kill him and MLF, and then I can clean up with anything if it goes south. I might be able to one-shot it. We'll see how it goes. Switch Sunflower and Gambit. I like Gambit off to the side. I guess I guess going I guess on defense he's better off to the side. Against the AI, he's probably better in the middle. Or do I have those backwards? I'm not sure. Why doesn't their Dormammu have an immunity? Hmm. With little to no editing. Let's try that swap with the with those two. Problems. I would never thought that you could be causing these problems. It smells so bright with eyes like these diamonds. Caution. I know I should have known. We're gonna save that team and hold on a second. Before I go crazy. Enable potato. There we go. Potato mode activated. Let's see if we can get through this one, huh? Yeah, Pathfinder, the reason I need your Mamu here is because I'm controlling him. I don't, well. I probably didn't need Dormammu there until the game crashed, and now I'm going back in, and I need to be damn sure it works this time. Watch the ability block not land this time. Yeah, Mr. Wolf, I, I realized that after I ability blocked Agatha. Probably should have done Wong. Okay, so this time I can go ahead and do this now. He didn't get devastated, so I can actually go through these in a better order. Well, we can give some speed up to the team, I guess. <clears throat> yeah, 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 Man, Rogue can take the hits, right? I'm thoroughly impressed with that character. Did Agatha have... Wow. Pretty tanky for an old lady. God knows how many of these positive effects are actually real.
Hey, buddy. Oh my god, Pathfinder's in my ear. <laughs> How's it going? It's going good. I forgot I was in the stream channel. <laughs> I'm having I'm having a morning. I'm having a ghost buff uh, morning, and I'm uh, getting a little worked up. I, I probably need to calm down. Well, you know, if it makes you uh, if it makes you feel any better, Scopely is going to give you two and a half orbs for your trouble. Oh, that's that makes me feel great. That makes me feel great. Hey, we realize that they are readjusting the milestones in the vision toxic vision event or whatever that thing's called. I didn't realize that. So, um, toxic vision is, is what it should be called. Toxic vision. Okay. That's it. RC Martinix with the follow. Appreciate that. Yeah. I, I probably didn't need to use Dormammu on that first team as you saw, but I'm glad I did because now I see how that works. So I'll know ne next time. Uh, I imagine though that they won't update the viral vision web milestone until reset. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably going to be what the, the five o'clock reset our time or is it four o'clock with, I don't time zones and they move the things around. I can't keep track of anything. Yeah. So I'm recommending people still continue to blitz. Yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing six. Well, I just set my two hour, two hour timer and I'm just going through as often as I can. If I'm not busy, I blitz. If I if I am busy, well, then I just don't do it. I'm not going to ruin my life for this, but um, I do happen to have two easy days today and yesterday. So I'm trying to get in as many as I can. Oh, in their life over this game. It's not worth it. Yeah. What are we using on the gamma in five? What do you have? Good question. What do I got left? Can you use a dark hold? I don't love that. But you could try it. Um, do you have like the Doom, Red Guardian, Omega Red type of a team? Unfortunately, I took Omega Red out of there, but I could, or not Omega Red. I took, I took Red Guardian out of there, but I could throw Drax back in there. Would it work with Drax? I mean, the pre-taunting uh, and of it still it should be fine. I've got Star Lord to force feed Doom energy, no matter what. Um, you shouldn't need that. I don't think. What? How big is the? Uh, how big is the Red Hulk? Red Hulk is G fifteen, hundred and forty four thousand. Ooh, okay. not not very big. I don't think he's gonna push Doom over the edge, no matter what. No, I think I gotta that, have Star Lord. That Red Hulk. Um. So I would have Drax on the side, Emma next to him, and then Omega in the middle. And then Doom and Star Lord off to one side. That's what I would do. Drax. And then if I were you, I don't know if you have your Star Lord at Green Five. I would change him to Skirmisher. Let's see, what's he at? He is a striker, your tier 14, green striker. That's not very good. I don't have Drax. Drax is on defense or something someplace. Uh oh. Rut row. Oh, well, uh, uh, that, that could be bad with Emma. You should still be. Mm, All I've got for pre taunts is Bishop and I don't really want to break up my Axemen. Yeah, that's not going to be very good. Well, let's hold on. Let's take a look. I'm going to save this team. Let's take a look. Do we need the Axemen for anything? So I can use my essay Kestrel Fury team on this should be able to take it out. Mm -hmm. Because they'll just they'll just go so fast. I can just blow it up before they take a turn, right? You could also use it just on the axemen that are there. I could also use it on the axemen here. I'll delete their bishop on turn one with the uh, Kestrel alt and just chew through beast and it should fold easy there with S.A. Kestrel also. However, I have Y.A. and Y.A. should be able to take them or at least. <laughs> get... see, we don't have Red Guardian. Yeah, we don't we don't have Red Guardian, unfortunately, but. <laughs> I could use the YA and if YA doesn't work, I can two tap it. I can come back in with infinity watch and beat it or something. YA, YA will, would win easily. Yeah. So and I also have, there. you could put Bishop there. Then you should be able to, I, I think that's what I should do. I think I should put Bishop here and then I will not use my Axemen anywhere else. 
Yeah, that should be fine. How did I not save that with Bishop in that slot? Okay, let's give this a shot. The um, goal um, here is... is structure if you can. Okay. You don't want him to eat up any, any vulnerable. Okay. Uh, I don't know where he's at, but he's not very... He's not very big, so I better... I better filter. Wow. Wow, he's nothing. Okay. He is literally there for energy and energy alone. Okay, <clears throat> we're going to take this Gamma on and we're going to do it with this crazy team that probably shouldn't be built by anybody or used by anybody because Bishop's important for the Axemen, but since we're not going to be using Axemen on the rest of the lineup, this should hopefully work. You should be okay. All right. <clears throat> um, since I don't see your screen on stream and you don't need to change it, just make sure that Red Hulk gets some um, vulnerables for Omega Red to, to use. There you go. You can see my screen now. Who am I? Uh, I, would do, I would do that on the Hulk since um, Red Hulk has immunity. immunity. Okay. And then do this on Red Hulk. There we go. Bishop did his job. Everything uh, on Red Hulk now? You, you should be fine to use the special or the ult, I guess. I'm going to go special. I really want to make sure that Red Hulk dies. Because he's, I mean, Jesus, look at, he's taking hits there. <clears throat> All right, right, now you can ult. Holy oh, crap. Oh, shit. Your just got taken. Oh, snap. Your Omega Red has less damage than your Bishop. It's a seven red Omega Red. How is that possible? Uh, just keep hitting, just keep hitting Red Hulk. You should be okay. He should still die. He's a, he's a baby Red Hulk. Oof, man. That sucks. Bishop doesn't even have offense up right now. He might as well ult. Doesn't matter. Uh, hit, Braun, because you, you can double tap. Get some of those death proofs, and then one more. No, uh, he's going to yeah, die on the... He's going to die, so I might as well use the ult and just yeah. get rid of two death proofs from each of them. Or one death proof from each of them. Hopefully you can clear through Braun and She-Hulk before Braun heals. That's going to be your issue. You may have to double check this. <laughs> I can't believe they took Bishop. Oh my gosh. Your Bishop didn't even have offense up, so I'm kind of confused. Because isn't your Omega like a monster? Well, we used, the, we used a special. Doesn't a special give him offense up for two turns? Yeah, I mean, that should have done it for you. I don't know what happened there. Come on, Omega Red, take a turn. Oh, that's a good point. The Age of X buff gave Bishop X. Oh, that's it. Yep. <laughs> Unbelievable. I guess I better use the alt, huh? Or the special? Yeah, it didn't matter. Funny, though. Drax, Drax is OP. <clears throat> wow. That sucks. I got. I'm gonna have to come back in there with I don't know Infinity Watch or something to hit them really hard. I mean, they didn't full clear you, so you should still be. Yeah. <clears throat> well, we learned something with that one. We learned something. All right, I'm gonna take. You might as well do Sa Kestrel into six. It, it'll be really. It'll be an easy. I think so. I, I think that's the safe choice there. Do I want Maria or should I swap her out? I don't. I think Maria's fine in here. Maria should be fine. No, Unspeakable OR is a villain mutant, so he doesn't get the same kind of buff as as Bishop did. If they if it was in six, then he would get a legendary buff. But that's it. And then special with Kestrel as well. And now you're 
whatever whatever you want to do. I'm gonna put a yeah, vulnerable sure. over here. This. So I saw uh, I was watching a Hargrave video and he was bagging on on Magneto and I'm like, how can you say that Magneto is such a terrible character and Psylocke's such a good character? But I was kind of looking it over and he's right outside of the raid team, outside of raids and outside of his team. He loses so much of the good stuff. Uh, Magneto is still better than Psylocke outside of raids. <laughs> But at least, but I, I'm not I'm not excited wide. I'm not excited to use Magneto as much as I was until I, I I thought about that like there's just a lot that he's now lacking like the whole basic the whole basic extending all those negative effects and everything was just amazing to me and then I was like oh but it's it's not there outside of raids yeah we're not we're not gonna love the team until we have the team yeah so oh, I, I think it's crucible little, uh. I think it's a little disingenuous to say that Magneto sucks. Yeah, I'm looking forward to using the Death Seed team in raids for sure, for sure. But I, I, I guess I wasn't paying attention when some of those reviews came out from Magneto, and I'm kind of dialing back my enthusiasm for him outside of the team, outside of raids. But still, once we have the full team, though, it'll be um, Archangel is going to have to be pretty bonkers for them. Um, to get what they need in order to clear everything in like Doom 3.4 or 3.5. So I expect the team to be pretty powerful. They're just not going to be like as powerful outside of raids. But mm -hmm. that's basically the Web Warriors. That's basically, I mean, I think Axemen fall into the same boat, but not as much. I don't think this really matters. Do you still have Darkhold? Yeah. Oh, geez. Yeah, you're you're good. You're plenty good. Yeah, I have a pretty stripped out defense. <clears throat> I like keeping my options open. Yeah, I'm Dondell. We're not saying that Magneto sucks as a character. I just think that he is really stacked for raids on his team. How come Loki didn't take a turn right there? That's uh, why did Loki not take a turn? Okay, whatever. That wasn't at all what I was expecting, but whatever. I got the double tap anyways. Two turn kill. That's fine with me. I guess it's a good thing Loki didn't take a turn. It would have given me a worse score. All right, we'll do the YA into Axemen real quick, and then we'll come back and see what's left to clean up Gamma. This is almost a punch across, slight punch down. I think that using Darkhold on the rest of Gamma, you'll be fine. Yeah, I think I, I'm not too worried about being able to clear the room. I'm mostly pissed off about it. that guy's going to look at that and just be like, how did he lose that match? How, why did he call that cancel? That drives me nuts. I think you should message him and say Scopely sucks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Room one, Scopely error, not me. <laughs> <clears throat> hey, did you, were you playing, uh, are you playing on Tiny Tina's without me? Are you cheating on me with Tiny Tina? No, I would never do that. Okay. I, mean, I, did, play, I did play a second stream to see if it got better after I changed my bit rate from a potato bit rate to normal bit rate. Mm-hmm. And it did work better. Yeah. So that was good. Yeah, I have like three characters going. So I have one character that I play offline to just dick around with. And then I have the one that I play on Saturday nights. And then I have the one that I play with you on Friday nights. So I'm trying to, I, I don't want to like get my character too far ahead of you so that we can stay pretty even. Yeah, if I, if I end up, um, able to play Saturday nights late. I think I might start a new character for that too, just to have a some variety. Okay. Well, I think me and Sifu Shan are only at like level ten or twelve or something like that. We're not very far. No. But it's it's a good time. So, and you guys in chat can join us too on the weekends at my stream or Pathfinders. Take your pick. We're 
it's just getting away from MSF on the weekends is all we're doing. We want to do the heel here, get our team points back up. America Chavez doing work. I forget how how hard America Chavez hits. Man, she I mean, she can do some damage right now. Oh, her special is always hit hard. Yes, Juicy. I have Squirrel Girl as a healer. I like her as a healer. That was that was a a, a, a conscious decision on my part, and I'm happy about it. So don't judge me. Who do I want as my fifth in here? Is there anybody cool? I could throw in Adam Warlock for an ability block. I guess I could just go Scarlet Witch. Um, well, who's who's like the worst character on your roster? Why? Why do we want to go with the worst? Just to make it look funny when when they go back and look at it. Like, <laughs> oh, they use this random level one character. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could, but I get nervous about doing stuff like that. Dude, you have you have MLF here. Yeah, you're fine. Throw no in, I could throw in a level one noir. There you go. That's what I would do. They Level one noir. noir, and they'll be like, they'll be like, what does he know about Noir's kit that I don't? And, this and Noir passively interact with the Darkhold. Level one Noir destroys Gamma. <laughs> I guarantee that video will get clicked. <laughs> Mad clicks. My first 1K video in weeks, man. Noir is about to do. <laughs> 66, 66 damage and crushing it. <laughs> Who's up yeah. for a turn? After She Hulk. Yeah. Rewind that turn meter. Stunner if you can. How dare they bring in She Hulk wearing the suit? I hate that suit. Dude, I'm telling you, if Noir survives. Oh, it's going to be great. Put it, you have to put it somewhere. No! Oh, oh, oh that would have been so haunted. cool. <laughs> I almost want to back out and try it again. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well. I don't even think I need to worry about the point score on this. <laughs> though. We can all recognize that. Oh. Build noir, build noir now. Level one noir destroys gamma. Yeah, that's what it's. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that in the thumbnail. So everybody, everybody knows Run Seven's using more and more clickbait in his thumbnails. So there we go. Oh. Well, hey, you won. That's there we go. Matters. Got the victory. That's all that matters. <sighs> yep. Yeah. Uh, easy win, simply because they could not get through. My tangled dad bros of all things. Oh, wow. They just straight up couldn't do anything. Just couldn't do it. And I mean, Infinity Watch, right? You just use Infinity Watch on that. I mean, if you got a big enough Infinity Watch, yeah. So. Man. Well, he's got Teal Gear Zim, so he's probably got a pretty big Infinity Watch, I'm guessing. Three red Zim, by the way. What's that? Yes, the three red stars. I'll be Iron Man. Oh, really? I didn't notice that. Oh, wow. What is that? 3,000 dark promo? Three, three by five Zim. I wonder if he feels bad now that he realizes that a two star Zim does almost the same thing. Oh, <sighs> man. Congratulations, Run7. Thank you, Pathfinder Gaming. I appreciate oh, that. <laughs> Everyone knows that Castfinder Gaming was here to help you win. That's right. And don't, don't, uh, don't be a denier. Yes, let's uh, let's get a shout out for Pathfinder Gaming. Pathfinder. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> <clears throat> All right, and I think I don't I don't see how this stream could get any better than that. I don't want to bother doing my pestilence saga. Uh, I think I have another 20 minutes before my blitz alarm is going to go off. My war is done. My raids. I got to wait for raids to relaunch. So I think I'm done for the day. I'm going to call it quits and go raid somebody else. So who's streaming right now? Uh, you got Sin Raven and the Zero Network. Uh, I did the Zero Network the other day. Let's go to Sin Raven then.
Windfall's still streaming. Wow, he's been on all morning long. Sen's just warming up. We'll go over to Sen Raven. <clears throat> all right, everybody. Be sure to go like and subscribe Pathfinder Gaming. I'll catch you here on Friday. We'll probably be prepped and ready to watch the blog post or something. Not on my stream, because I do that beforehand. But um, thanks for everybody showing up, and I will catch you all next time. Bye.